Lake Nakuru, Kenya. On a continent where humans and wildlife strike an uneasy balance. The snarling big cat was captured after killing farm animals. Villagers worried they could be next. Now they transport the 200 pound predator to safer territory, deep under the African savanna. They expect the solitary hunter to leave on its own. But even with careful preparation, there's a problem. The big cat won't budge from her cage. The ranger tries giving a nudge in the right direction. But the animal shows her displeasure by bearing 32 knife-like teeth. Soon, the irritated carnivore wants more than freedom. She wants revenge. The 100-pound cat bolts out of her cage and makes a move that catches everyone off guard. The ferocious feline hurdles to the truck cab, bearing claws designed for eviscerating prey. Panicking, the ranger grasps for the window crank and makes a grave error. He rolls the glass down instead of up. Now the leopard leaps in, swiping with 18 talons kept razor sharp by clawing at bark. In an instant, she's capable of puncturing her quarry's throat with a single bite. The desperate man knows this and struggles to keep the cat from tearing him to shreds. The leopard repeatedly slashes his head and chest here and here. She also sinks her two inch long teeth into his hands. A lucky kick sends the attacker flying. Having made her point, she scampers away, leaving the stunned ranger alive, but with serious lacerations. It takes 21 stitches to close his bloody wounds. But when provoked, this most dangerous of big cats shows that it's anything but bashful. I was terrified, and it hurt me pretty badly. Look at my head. It's cracked. It ripped apart. Almost made me blind. I learned a very painful lesson I will never forget. I thank God that is alive today.